you started making money, but then you be you were broke at some point, right? When okay. you were sitting in your grandma's couch, how was that like? And how what did you have to tell your Chris Thomas to get out of that couch and freaking make it happen and, and stop feeding negativity into yourself, right? Man, that's crazy you say that, bro, because that was absolutely true. Um, you know, when I when I it was oh, yeah, I remember, you know, I started two startups, it didn't just happen overnight, guys. You know, I started two startup companies, you know, software companies. I'm a sales guy and a marketing guy, and uh, I don't know how to sell software. And that starting those companies, you know, left me, you know, almost seventy thousand dollars in debt collectively, personal and professional. Um, it was about almost eighty thousand dollars in debt, and I was on my grandma's couch, you know, and envious of all these young dudes, bro, that were just like yeah. fucking doing it on the internet. Man, I was like, damn, these dudes are doing it. So one day I just searched up, you know, real estate, real estate, fastest way to get into real estate, how to get rich with real estate. You know, I've always saw myself in real estate in some shape or form when I was young. Um, and uh, I touched this thing called Airbnb. I was like, wow, you know, this was like early 2000 and what, 15? Um, and I saw this thing called Airbnb and I saw these nerds just crushing it. I was like, wow, bro, if I can start a business in this, maybe I could be successful. I was like, shit, you know, just try it. You know, my lady, you know, has been down with me since day one, you know, being broke, homeless, sleeping in cars. And she said, you know what? Screw that software company, close down the office, everything, because we're sleeping in the office, you know, and then we get to my grandma's house because we left the office. It's like, just close down those companies and let's start something new. 